Well, hello there again, and welcome back to the channel. Today, um, I'm just going to be working on uh, sanding the spokes on all the wheels and getting them ready to, to get some linseed oil in there. And uh, actually, I was looking at them earlier there, and actually, uh, all of them are in pretty good shape, so um, that's a good thing because those things are, uh, it's a lot of money to replace those spokes. 12 of them on each wheel, that's 144 spokes. So I'm, I'm really glad that that's the case that all I have to do is uh, sand them off and, and soak them up. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and get started with that. The reason I'm not doing anything with the body or, or any of that yet is because I just, uh, I ordered, I've ordered parts and I, as yet they haven't shipped. So I really don't want to get carried away until I do uh, get some parts in the shop. So we will just do things like uh, uh, continue to clean up these wheels. I'll um, get some more sanding work done on the frame. And uh, I picked up some uh, uh, primer and some paint. Uh, it's enamel so we can get that frame painted up and after it's all cleaned up. Anyway, a lot of work to do yet. So I'm going to go ahead and get uh, onto the wheels and uh, we'll go through them. I'm not going to do them all because it, it takes a, a little while for each wheel, but you'll get the idea. So let's get started. I've got the whole car on jack stands, uh, so it's off the floor. It doesn't look like it, but uh, that way I can get to all these wheels and roll everything around. I've been using some 20, uh, 220 grit paper. It, it cleans off the any of the flaky stuff and, and works real well with just getting it smoothed off. And I was, I had some that I've had around here for years and boy it's so brittle I couldn't even couldn't even use it so we'll see what some of this will do. Oh, it feels better already than that old stuff. Okay, I was on the inside and I did the what I could reach easily from from this side. So now we'll just go ahead and take care of what we got on this side. Yeah, this is going to take some time. You've seen a lot of people paint the spokes red or black or whatever color. I don't know, I just, I like the uh, natural wood look. There we go. That's one wheel. Just make a quick check, make sure I didn't miss anything. That's all there is to it. We got that wheel done, and we'll move on to the next. 
Okay, time to put a little linseed oil on here. And we'll start at the valve stem just as a guide here so we know where we're going. Okay, so this is uh, um, taking care of the wheels in our restoration project. So I invite you all to uh, stay tuned as we continue on and, and uh, put more and more of these videos together on this old Model T. And uh, it'll be under the uh, um, playlist. I'll uh, put all these in the playlist for that restoration. So. I uh, really appreciate you watching and we appreciate your support and, and your comments as well. So you uh, all have a wonderful day and I thank you so much for watching.